Hey everybody, Quinn here, and today I'll be teaching you how to draw a common vampire bat. So the first thing you're going to draw, start ahead. Out of all the bat species on Earth, the common, common vampire bat is the most misunderstood of all the bat species. Oh yeah, and its scientific name is this, this Mondus rotundus. The ears here. Now, these guys live live in Central and South America, and also part of Trinidad, Trinidad and Tobago, which are two tiny little islands. Yep, and they live in colonies, almost completely dark places like caves, old wells, old trees, and buildings. Range in Central to South America, in arid to humid tropical and subtropical areas. Oh yeah, don't think of the, don't think of them as the harmful vampires you see on television. Morphing vampires you see on television. In reality, vampire bats are actually very shy creatures who tend to stay away from humans as far as possible. These guys don't feed in the blood of humans. They actually suck the blood of live people's livestock, like chicken or cows and donkeys. Oh yeah, and there are also many misconceptions about them. Like how some say that bats are blind, but that's not actually true at all. Oh, you see, even though, though they use use like a local which is the same thing that shrews and dolphins use. They do have the ability to see, however, since most of them are in the dark, eyesight isn't much much required, and instead they do, the, do that to determine the location and distance of their prey. Oh yeah, and some say that bats aren't clean. Well, that's not true either, since these guys do like being are actually clean animals, and you do like to clean often. And some also say that they are like birds, since they, since they have wings, like birds do. But that's actually untrue as well, because these guys are actually mammals like us, because they have hair, and that's are very different from birds, as as birds have wings made of feathers, bats have a thick membrane of brain for wings, which unfortunately breaks very easy, very easily than birds do. Oh and yeah, and scientists used to think that these bats like the common vampire bat were actually more closely related to primates because of their, their skeleton skeletal appearance, but recent recent studies have shown that they're actually more closely related to rodents than the primates, as we used to think. Mm, draw the body. Mm. Oh, and yeah, and these guys had the ability to share their blood with other members of their, of their colony if they don't have enough. Which actually, if these guys don't have enough blood to drink for the whole night, they'll actually die. But blood is a kind of plasmum that we, they can't, that they can't, and most animals can't drink. Or suck that is. Let's see, we draw it right here. Let me draw 
the Let me make the legs a little longer. And now we just draw the membrane or the wing of the bat. Let's draw the fingers. Now, a long time ago, these guys were descended from small animals who didn't have those membrane wings. Those mem membrane like for wings. They just had fingers and paws like normal mammals do. But for a long, but after millions of years of evolution, these guys had evolved. Remember, like wings, so they can be able to fly. In fact, bats are the only flying mammal mammals on Earth. But there are some wannabe mammals out there who don't actually fly, but they do glide, or like flying possum, some flying squirrels. But these guys are the true are the true flyers when it comes to flight. Oh yeah, and these guys are the only mammals on the planet who survive solely on blood, just to survive. And their, and their basal social structures are made out of harems, are composed of females and their offspring, and a few adult male, males are known as resident males, and the reciprocal males are known as non-resident males. And yeah. About the thing, about the thing about the he thing, the I think mean, humans, they do kind of suck the blood of humans, a k humans. It's just occasional. membrane and now it's time to color it in
And that's it. Now you know how to draw a con, con vampire bat. Let me get the ears on a bit. Alright, now we're done. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe and hit the notification button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.